find at UCLA that everyone here from residents to fellows to attendings is super approachable and you'll form relationships with people even, you know, regardless of what the area of medicine they might be in. I was interested in GI and hepatology from my beginning stages of residency and found wonderful fellow and attending mentors. Despite coming home for fellowship, those people have remained my mentors and have helped guide my career and I plan to do the same for those that I mentor. All it takes is just, you know, identifying someone you're interested in working with and um, talking to them and they kind of take it from there. There's not too much work involved with finding a really good mentor here. I found it actually very easy to find one of my mentors who I ended up you know, writing a paper with. Um, it was just very easy sort of to reach out to him and say, hey, I'm interested in doing a project. And just like that, you know, we were writing something within the next week. One of the projects that I would say I'm most proud about working here has been what we call our Internoon Conference which is a weekly didactic curriculum targeting high yield topics in internal medicine. Um, it also includes the prelims. It's something that I've worked on with one of my, my, my mentors, Dr. Brooke. You came here, you fully embraced UCLA, you fully embraced residency, and you were really excited about teaching. And I watched you grow from like an intern and learn how to be a doctor, right? And then to really think about structure and like the joint mentorship is when you see someone and you know, you again, you help them become the best possible version of that they can be of themselves. Most of the faculty here are very friendly, very approachable, and uh, very down to earth. And uh, oftentimes, you know, we'll be more than happy to connect over the phone or, you know, over a cup of coffee. Um, with most of the residents, so it's been wonderful. We helped kind of enhance the, the mentorship program here. We basically have every intern who comes in from day one of residency is gonna be paired with a third year resident mentor, and that's usually based on uh, shared career interests. We know that not every intern knows exactly what they wanna do career-wise, but we do know that um, having kind of an early relationship with a third year who's already been through this process is gonna help them to figure out what to do next. We're also hoping to do some like education on how best to be a mentee and what our responsibility is as residents uh, in those relationships. The jump to our two years is actually huge and having those R3 mentors um, help us uh, you know, lead teams and meet our career goals has been pivotal for our development as second year residents.